Hello. It is Monday, 27th of January. We have just done the first job in Bedford-ish. And we delivered a backpack from Southwold, which is uh, middle of nowhere. It was 115 miles for 90 pounds. Um, not the best freight, but it was agreed really late on Sunday. Um, I think 10, no, 11, half past 11, I think we um, we started exchanging texts. And yeah, here we are, I'm looking for another job, but it is really quiet. There, there are occasional jobs popping in, but there's like so many drivers here, so much struggle to find some anything. Luckily, we are um, in Sainsbury's and they have a three hour parking here, so yeah, we are safe. I forgot to mention I've got some new toys. Uh, one of them is the air compressor, and the second one is a trolley, both from Amazon. I think total was less than 50 pounds. We'll see if um, they can help. Out. I've, I've seen a lot of jobs requesting um, trolleys recently. So. Morning, all. So, today is Wednesday. Uh, yesterday, on Tuesday, we have done one job. Sadly, the platform was down, so we couldn't find anything before that job or after. Um, it went from Ipswich to Wellingborough, I think, 100 miles or so. And yeah, we got uh, some waiting time because the loading site was absolute pain and. Today we are going to the castle, uh, from Lamb Castle. Should be exciting. So, here's the delivery edge, and here's the destination. Closed. So, we are driving towards the castle. Hello, today is Wednesday, we had um, two jobs. First one was Ipswich to Framlingham Castle. We actually drove through the gate into the castle, which was exciting. Um, second one was Sudbury to Ipswich, which I done before, heavy pallet. And throughout the day I kept getting this um, error message of, um, it says, oil, insufficient oil pressure. Now, I went to Peugeot dealer, they said the earliest they could check this is um, next Thursday. I was like, ah, I'm gonna wait a long So I went to a front mechanic, just happened it was before his lunch break, so he said he'll look at it during the lunch. And we have diagnosed it, and we think it's the switch. So, go a second switch. That switch could not fit, it just it wasn't working, it should be the, the correct part, but it wasn't working, so put the old one back on. And yeah, there, there seemed to disappear for a bit, um, but uh, obviously it needs to be replaced as soon as possible, so hopefully tomorrow we can fix it. Uh, but for the time being, I just have this annoying error coming up every time I, the breaths drop below 1000 RPM, so... Not fun. Uh, what else? It's an okay day. I think I made eighty pounds today. Mainly, it was a good job. Good jobs. So I've, I've done about sixty, maybe seventy miles. So as far as days go, okay. But as far as this week goes, uh, not not great. I think uh, rubbing away. We are on two hundred and sixty or seventy. Uh, and cost is uh, over a hundred so far. So, mm, 
not the best. Uh, but I can confirm the jobs are picking up. There's more work being posted on CX, so that's a good thing. Maybe because the system was out yesterday, or hopefully because it, the um, the industry is, is on the rise again. But yeah. It is Thursday, 30th of January, and I'm not having much luck with my van. Uh, so throughout the week, I keep getting this um, oil pressure. Uh, warning light, it was uh, saying insufficient oil pressure level. I checked it yesterday. We think the issue is the oil sensor plug thing. <laughs> Um, so I've got a new one in Ipswich, but sadly couldn't fit it yesterday, so I've done a job from, I've been off nowhere, lower stuff to outside of um, Barry, uh, Elmsworth I think, and yeah, throughout the, the journey the sensor kept, uh, the warning like kept beeping every like 30 seconds, maybe, maybe even more. And on the A14 the engine sounded a little rough, so hopefully nothing happened. Um, I've stopped, I've checked the oils, everything I could, but obviously there was much I could do. So I delivered the pallets, driving extremely slow with a really low RPM, and it seemed to be okay. Um, when I stopped on the workshop, they luckily said I can leave it on here. They will fit the switch and possibly do another change. Um, I'm not sure about that yet. Um, may definitely di diagnose what the issue is and call me. So I think this is the end of the week for a change. <laughs> Last day Thursday. Mm. To my flat in Ipswich Football Stadium. Uh, yeah, the process is really quick. I think I've been there for maybe 40 minutes because I was early. And it took me about 10 minutes to fill up the bag. The bag is almost a pint, 480 milliliters. Yeah, it's it's an interesting process. Um, but yeah, you never know when you get. Please donate.